everyone, I'm Rita Herring and uh, today I was going to do an unboxing of the Paramore, uh, Paramore, I'm pretty sure that's what it was called in this box, um, Paramore <laughs> menstrual cup that I purchased on, uh, on Amazon and it came from the Rocket Steels uh, company, I guess, in Kentucky or that's where it was shipped out from. Um, and I went ahead and cut open my box, but here is, uh, this cup. I actually ordered two different cups that day, but, uh, they weren't shipped out from the same place. So this one came from Kentucky and it was the only one in the box. A lot of times when I order, um, a couple things from Amazon, they come in the same box, but it, it's, it's not the case this time. So I'm going to go ahead and take this out. And um, this is a hard case box. And it says moon on it. I'm not really sure what that means. So Paramore, Paramore, however you want to pronounce this. Um, I did not contact the company for any kind of information. I just saw it and bought it. Um, I, had, I had purchased a uh, de-stashed cup over a month ago and I was waiting for it but um, the person I purchased it from had fell sick and uh, she didn't get my cup out to me and so she refunded my my money and I had some money floating in PayPal and I was like well you know what I'm just gonna go and um, find a cup similar to that and I found that cup or, or the other cup that was similar to the cup that I was trying to buy and this one so I went ahead and picked both of those up but this is not the one that I had uh, purchased but it was kind of an impulse buy just because I didn't get that other cup originally that I had uh, purchased from that person now I'm ram rambling so I'm just gonna go ahead and um, do a quick turnaround of this box and this is a really nice box but really it's going to get thrown away so maybe uh, minimal packaging would have probably been better so it says designed in Germany down here if you see it and made in China and um, I did kind of read a little bit about this one year warranty sorry hold on um, Lifespan of your moon plus will be greatly increased with proper maintenance and care. Blah, blah, blah. Don't use silicone based lubricant. It'll make the silicone surface permanently tacky. Okay. Um, so <clears throat> I did some research when I saw this just a little bit. And um, hi, Manini. This is manini, which means small in Hawaiian. We also have a fish that's called a manini because it's small. So here I'm trying to open up the box, but oh, okay. So I did a little bit of research on this and um, it seems like the certificates that they included on their, their um, listing was for their sex toys because they do carry sex toys on their website. If you go to their actual website, there's a banner up there with a bunch of girls and their butts and g-strings and I kind of didn't appreciate that for some reason. I don't know. But um, they have sex toys and the certificates that they listed with the menstrual cup was actually for the sex toys and not the menstrual cup. So I don't know if the menstrual cup is um, like registered with the FDA or if they had done any testing on it. So um, if you pick up this up before I get to do any further research on it or if you don't research it yourself, um, you know, that's up to you. So <clears throat> kind of tight there, but uh, here are the cups and it did come in a two pack. It was $19.99 and I have Prime, so uh, shipping was free. Um, you get size 1 and 2 and it kind of looks like it glows, doesn't it? If I turn it to the side, it looks like it glows. Oh my god, it really does. I have to test. No, it doesn't. <laughs> if I open my hand just a little bit, a little bit, and let a little bit of light in, it really, really looks like it glows. Look at that. 
Can you see that? It looks like it's glowing, but it doesn't. So um, you get two different sizes, and they actually feel really nice. Um, I am kind of surprised. So they have a smell. Not a plasticky smell, smell but uh, it might be just the packaging, this foam stuff. Yeah, it smells like the foam. So, um, it doesn't smell like plastic or anything. Not how some of my China, other China cheapies would come. So anyhow, you get these two cups. And I really, really liked the design of it. Um, I haven't seen any other cup that's really like this. Um, it kind of reminds me of... Um, and I did bring these cups because when I saw the picture, this is what it reminded me of. Um, if the Lunette, <laughs> the Lunette and the Love Your Body had a baby. So that's what they kind of look like. The top half of this cup looks like the Lunette. So if I covered this, it looks like the Lunette. And if I covered the top of this, it looks like a Love Your Body. So I really like that it has the flare down here. Um, but then it's shorter, because uh, the um, Love Your Body didn't really agree with me. So this is really nice. It has a, a tab style stem. It's flat, just like the Lunette. If I turn it to the side... <laughs> My doggy. If I turn it to the side, it is uh, thin there, and then it has three grip rings on it. It's not as stiff as the Lunette. It has a nice... A nice... Uh, Nice resistance, I think. It's a good middle. Um, maybe just a little bit too firm for some, but for the most part, it seems like a really good middle cup. Um, three grip rings down there, um, but they do have a, a seam, just like the lunette that goes all the way. Actually, the lunette and the Love Your Body both have seams that go up and over the stem and back down the other side. Um, and then there is also a seam that goes around the rim, right on the top of it. And you can see it right there. Didn't clean those off. Quite nice, but uh, it's just kind of like my lunette. You can see the the um, seam on my lunette. Uh, I I would say that this one it feels softer. Like this one moves back and forth on my finger nicer than the the silicone extras on the lunette does. But it has um, two holes on this, and they didn't put it on the seam. Uh, I only said that because I remember Jennifer just saying in one of her um, videos that one of the cups they put the um, air holes right on the seam and it sucked for her. Um, so here is one of the holes and here is the other. If you can see that okay. And the holes are quite small. I'm going to hold it up to the light so that I can see that it's punched all the way through or not. And it does look like they're punched all the way through. Kind of looks like they're, they travel in a downward, um, or they travel downward, so from the outside it looks like it's higher and then it goes inward toward the cup, uh, inside of the cup, but not a whole bunch. And let me check this other one. I don't know, it's not a whole bunch, but it just very little bit like this, instead of straight, it's kind of like that, slanted a little bit. So I'm I'm a little worried because I don't know any um, information about this cup. Um, I saw that it was also called Dream Lover, um, so I will look more into to that information and see what I come up with and I'll let you know as soon as I can, um, but I am also excited to try this cup just because it's a different shape and I was really excited about that shape of this cup so um, 
I'll let you know how it goes. Again, uh, I am putting out three unboxing videos today, and I had done one already for um, the flower pot, and if you hadn't seen that one, you can go see that one. Um, but I, I, I do have, or I am on my period right now, so I'm gonna go ahead and get all of my cups cleaned up and test them out during this period. Um, so it'll prob probably be a quick a quick um, testing time just because I already had my period for a couple days or a few days um, and so I, I don't know how much information or I'm go going to collect collect with these cups at this time but um, I will try them out and let you know how inserting it was, how it felt, um, if it was comfortable for me and, and whatnot so um, Yep, that's it. Uh, so I'm going to repeat this again because <laughs> I just did on my other video. But I just realized that some of you have been leaving me messages through uh, YouTube. And YouTube doesn't put messages someplace really easy to see. They don't send me notifications. If they do and I just didn't turn it on, please let me know. But um, I don't get any notifications that you've been messaging me here. I only get notifications when you leave comments below. Um, so I will try to be a little bit better about checking my messages here on YouTube, but um, if you don't want to leave a comment below for everybody to see, please message me on Facebook. It's a lot easier. I get a notification. Um, if my face if my Facebook messages are turned on on my phone or my tablet when I'm out of the house I also get those messages right away so um, if you leave it here I promise I'll find it but I just don't know uh, how long it'll be before I find it so um, check out my other videos that are going to be uploaded all today or tomorrow depending on when I edit it but they'll all be up at the same time. Um, until then, take care.